taking a taxi to a mirror float at Lux. Flores Lux and it's hot. And the first thing we did when we arrived was we went to the ticketing booth and we got uh, some tickets to go see the IMAX video that tells us all about the Panama Canal. They have their own full on IMAX movie theater, complete with, you know, concessions. Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you. Gracias. Bienvenido. The ship is going on. When we arrived at the Miraflores Locks, we were amazed to see this enormous ship passing through the locks. This particular ship has the capacity to carry over 5,000 vehicles. This is considered a medium-sized vessel because it only uses six locomotives to get it through the locks rather than the eight required if it were a large vessel. Cutting through the canal saves almost a month of journey, as well as tens of millions of dollars for these shipping companies. These itty bitty gray locomotives are the little itty bitty things that help these enormous ships through the canal. So far, the largest passenger ship that's ever crossed through the canal is the Norwegian Bliss. We tried to eat at the restaurant at the Miraflores Locks, but apparently it's been closed for a little while. So when we came up here and we asked them about the restaurant, they kept telling us that it was over by the visitor center, and then we got there and there was no restaurant. first movie I'm going to watch in 3D. That you remember? That I remember. <laughs> it's going to be cold in this theater and I'm going to freeze to death. <laughs> Check out Bronson's fancy new glasses. After going to the IMAX theater and checking out the Panama Canal, we decided to go to a Frank Gehry building out here in Panama called the Bio Museo, which is like a biology museum. It's located just outside the city. The cost is $18 for non-residents, adults, and 10 if you're a resident.
fossils inside this rock. You can see this one right there. There are essentially two museums in Panama for the Panama Canal. One is in Casco Viejo and the other one is at the visitor center at Miraflores. If you like this content, don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you next time.